So, welcome back. Uh, morning, afternoon, or evening, whenever you're watching. Um, because of the wonderfulness that I did, I probably shouldn't be talking in that direction because I don't know if the mic's picking it up. But um, because of the wonderfulness that happened when on uh, one of the last recoveries, I have to replace my diff cover on the Jeep. And for those that know, yeah, it's still a stock Jeep axle. Um, I am looking to upgrade those, just not able to at this current time being. Um, yeah, got to replace the diff cover. Thank you for joining us. and do the same on the axle and uh, I'm going to find out and remember what type of locker I've got so I know what type of fluid I need to get if it's cl clutch activated locker or if it's actually a spool or what well, I can't remember we bought this Jeep this way other than the winch so anyway Get to it. And no, this isn't the easiest way to do it, but I don't have a, uh, a wire wheel on a <clears throat> on a stand, so. I can't, that I won't, that I fail, that I'll never make it out, yeah. Please tell me all the bad, never good, fill my head full of every single doubt, yeah. Please say any negative thoughts, I pop off when I hear people say I cannot. I get off to the thought of proving everyone wrong, I won't stop to the top, so you better back off and get lost. I'ma stay loud, stay proud, never running out, never heading south. I'll be spreading out, call it word of mouth, can't bring me down, I'll be getting loud. You can never doubt, know what I'm about, have your f***ing cloud, it be raining now. I keep making sound, go another round, time legend bound, can't stop me now. You don't wanna f*** with me. A slow burn like a disease Just tell me that I can and I'll show you things that you couldn't believe Just tell me that I can 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 Well, now that I got most of it off of there, um, I'm going to take some scotch Bright and clean off the rest and a little bit of brake clean and clean it out. So, I don't have any scotch Bright. However, I do have some old steel wool, which should do the same job. I don't have a garage to actually do this in. I have to do it in a driveway. So it, it honestly, it doesn't matter if you have a garage, if you have the will and the tools to do it, you can do it in your driveway. That's what I'm doing. If I was at the shop, I have I would have my <laughs> I would have my uh, Scotch Bright, but I'm not at the shop, and I'm using what I've got at the house. Mm. Well, that looks pretty good, yeah. I 
never say anything negative Cause I just wanna hear it out your mouth, yeah Give me fuel, it's a tool that I use To go ahead and run my f mouth, yeah I take shots, I take loss, I make shots, I miss lots I tell you get big box, you get yachts You swing lots and pop off a big shot I'm done chasing, got big dreams, bigger things, impatient Who's at the top think they need replacement? Who's at the top think I'm gonna erase it? Face it, I don't give up quick, I don't give up I won't give up this Cleaned up the uh, new diff cover. I gotta climb under here and take out the old diff cover and uh, then do the same process on cleaning out the, or cleaning off the silicone. And, yep, we'll get that done. <laughs> so now I just need to take this off, this, this diff cover, because of this wonderful then you can actually see the teeth of the ring gear showing through and um, pull all the bolts off, pull that off which is probably glued on pretty good and um, clean the axle housing off and replace it with the new one really I guess new used because I just want to hear it out your mouth yeah Give me fuel, it's a tool that I use to go ahead and run my out, yeah. I take shots, I take loss, I make shots, I miss lots. I tell you get big box, you get yachts, you swing lots and pop off a big shot. I'm done chasing, got big dreams, bigger things, impatient. Who's at the top think they need replacement? Who's at the top think I'm gonna erase that face it? I don't give up quick, I don't give up, I won't give up this. Cause I know that I want it, know that I'm on it, I'll make it, I promise. You don't wanna fuck with me. A slow burn like a disease Just tell me that I can and show you things That you couldn't believe Just tell me that I can 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 Anyway, while I'm here, let me see that. I am looking at, oh, yeah. I'm looking at the teeth on both the pinion back up in there and on the ring gear to see if I did any damage. And it's not really looking like there's anything. I wish I would be able to spin the axle, but with over half of it, um, with over half of it visible, it's, it doesn't look like, uh, it's wearing unevenly on each side of the teeth. It looks like a decent pattern. And it's deep on into the pinion. So, and I've never really heard any noise from this thing, so it looks good. Now I just need to clean all the way around here uh, so that I can get a good mating surface and then clean it off with some brake clean and silicone it back on. And it looks like I just need 8090. Apparently that lunchbox locker is a pretty good locker. At least uh, the version that was bought for this. Tell me that I can't, that I won't, that I fail, that I'll never make it out, yeah. Please tell me all the bad, never good, fill my head full of every single doubt, yeah. Please say any negative thoughts, I pop off when I hear people say I cannot. I get off to the thought of proving everyone wrong, I won't stop to the top, so you better back off and get lost. I'ma stay loud, stay proud, never running out, never heading south. I'll be spreading out, call it word of mouth, can't bring me down, I'll be getting loud. You can never doubt, not what I'm about, have your f***ing clouds, it be raining now. I keep making sound, go another round, time legend bound, can't stop me now. You don't wanna f*** with me. A slow burn like a
That doesn't look like it was cleaned off very good from whenever uh, they put this locker in. My old silver Jeep had uh, Yukon lockers, but it also had a Dana 35 in the rear which is not the strongest. Uh, this axle is only slightly stronger. And yes, once again, I'm going to be upgrading them eventually. Okay, now that I got that cleaned off, somewhere around here is this. Hopefully that doesn't get on you. Yeah, I know, it smells bad. So I'm just cleaning up the bottom here to make sure that that seals so I don't have a leak when I uh, silicone this back up. And it would probably help if I had a nice pre-shading new one. Well, new to this Jeep. I actually grabbed this from Tear Apart. Oh my goodness. Got all this stuff. You want to make sure that mo both your mating services are clean. I use the ultra gray that's just a personal preference personally I think it works better but apparently blue and red doesn't show the didn't show any signs of leaks before previously don't need a lot but you definitely want to make sure that you have enough right where I wish I had rubber gloves because I do want this across the entire oh look snow yay please don't get on my silicone Doesn't have to be pretty. Uh, snowflakes, get out of here. And if I had a rubber glove, I just pull the rubber glove off and my hands clean. But that's at the shop. This another thing, you want to make sure you get your silicone the old silicone off the tips of your bolts because you can actually run the bolts in and because of that extra silicone on the end uh, it makes it a whole lot easier to snap a bolt not sure if anybody's ever told you that or if you ever heard of that anywhere but 
my experience, that happens. Once again, make sure that's clean before I start to bolt this up. Oh my goodness. Oh. It'd probably help if I tried to line up the holes first. I thought I had a bolt over here. <laughs> nice shiny clean on the inside and a dirty on the outside oh I didn't do that uh, see silicone and I mean it is only a quarter of an inch of silicone but I got brand new silicone that could be covering holes and you add a quarter of an inch to a quarter of an inch that's a half a freaking inch and your bolt doesn't go down it just tries to and because there's nowhere for that silicone to go to other than try to push your bolt back out or keep your bolt from going in and you don't want that I always like to start on the bottom in the middle when I start tightening it up. Now that I've got those started. So the reason why I put those in by hand first and then I'm going to, oh look, I forgot that. Don't forget your park brake cable mounting bracket. Sometimes there's the trucks that have them here and here and brake cable goes all the way across the top. Fortunately, the Jeep does not have that. Anyways. Start the bolts first, that, that don't just try to run them in because sometimes you cross thread them. Is that easy and then pull this off put fluid in we don't need to show you that that's pretty simple all it is is a rubber plug you pull it out with by hand and put your quart and a half of fluid in and that's it you get to ask Greg's garage on uh, Mountain West Extreme Off-Road Recovery website um, fill out the form to ask the question and uh, if it happens to run through the shop I'll actually show you and give you an answer on YouTube thanks for watching